PC. Okay, if you go to the Microsoft 365 developer program today, okay. So here you will see like Microsoft 365. Thank you for joining. You don't currently qualify for Microsoft 365 developer program sandbox subscription. So if this type of message is coming to you, so this video is for you. Okay, and if you want the work account for a Microsoft, then this video is for you. Okay, so let's see how to create it. Okay, for free of cost. Okay, we, uh, I will demonstrate it. Okay, so first, uh, um, I just gone through some of the document. Okay, you can see here. If you want. This document link I will provide in the comment box. So yeah. <clears throat> After that, we now we are going with the adding success with free Microsoft Partners program. Okay. So in this uh, partner program, you can get the all the benefits that are used in the same developer plan. Okay, like Word, Excel, Microsoft PowerPoint power <clears throat> platform access sharepoint on all other things you will get okay so let's i go so i will provide this link okay this is the link okay by using that you will creating an account okay http microsoft partner account okay so simply you have to select all the check boxes here okay you can select one according to you okay but for now let's just select all of them let's simply just click on the next it is uh, navigating to the another screen okay here one pop-up will get you welcome to partner center partner center is a single destination for your organization to manage your business relationship and partnering opportunities with Microsoft customers and other partners. Okay. So here you not have to create a login with your work account. So we have to create an first work account. So simply just click on the work account and create here your work account. Provide your country. In my case, I am from India. So I just provide India. Organization name. Let's provide name for organization okay that will display here i provide is anika let's providing the address mobile number here it's providing the uh, name then here we have to give the username and here is domain name that will display here. So let's providing a domain name it will verify just press the tab okay. <coughs> Simply then create your own password. Okay, password must be this type. Okay, it is showing. So just create, and here you can just do your alternate email address, and then simply just create. Click on the continue. Okay, after pressing on continue, it will take two minutes. Okay, to create an account. Okay, so let's like after that two minutes. Okay, you will get this type of window here okay your work account is ready okay and your current sign in app. we need this email id and password so that's why keep your email id and password at a safe place okay? so this email id we are copied here we are given name and here is our domain name okay? so simply now i just gone after that you will receive okay after clicking on this uh, next button, you will navigate to the join our program to unlock new opportunities. This partner program you will get. So you can be just uh, go with the commercial marketplace or you can simply register with extended co-pilot for my so 365 teams, office, SharePoint apps and plugins. So just click on this and just go with the new. But here, okay, if you not have an DS number okay your company is not authenticated in that case you will not able to proceed but no worries we are already created a work account that we needed so simply you have to go to the any service that you want like make dot 
power apps so simply i just go to the mac dot power apps okay and just provide your credentials okay for now i just sign in okay by using the same email id and password okay this is my organization name okay sanika and uh, here is our email id you can be see same email id similarly we are done for the microsoft uh, power automate okay now i demonstrate you for one more account okay that is microsoft power bi it is loading it will take some time because my computer is on load that's why so now you can be see we are directly authenticating to the microsoft power bi okay i simply click here on that it is just loading it will take some time That's why we are waiting. So here you can be say enter your email which so we need to create an account. So here we have to put our email address and simply click on the submit. So you can be see we are just have to click on the continue. Provide your mobile number. In this case, I just provide my mobile number. get started just click on the get started so your microsoft power so now here you so now here you can be see Your Microsoft account is created with the same email ID and password. Okay. License type is free account. Okay. We are using the free account here. And you can be <coughs> buy and use that also. Okay. If you need the other licenses, like other subscriptions like Words and Office 365, so simply you can be go to the Microsoft365.com. from here you can install all the apps like word excel powerpoint and so on and from here also you can access that in the mobile as well okay and also you can be go to the admin center from here okay by clicking on the and you can see all the admins and if you wants to add the new user okay I just refresh that so you can be see the current info. So here you can be see the license is assigned as Microsoft Fabric and Microsoft Power Automate free, as well as Power Apps. Okay, so we are created an work account by using a work account you can be easily site. up or to an any microsoft series program okay and you can access that easily so this is and in this you can also add the multiple user simply just click on add user and add the users and same you can assign all this all the licenses okay if you are the admin okay administrator so you can assign those licenses as well okay If you have any question, any doubt, you can be provide in the comment box. Okay, so I will.